up there. I guess it could be raining. It really could. Click it or take it. All right. Now we know that. We we'll always wear our seatbelt. At least I do. That's right. I'm happy that it was an easy crossing today. Yep. That means we're going to get in some miles today. That's right. That's what we like to see, right? At least I do. That's what I like to see. Anyways, let's get down down the road some fun while we're at it. Alrighty guys and gals, we are in Fargo, North Dakota. That's right. We are just about to take this exit up here. And then we'll be turning on to, uh, keep to the right on I-94 East, I-94 West, and then keep to the left in 900 feet. I guess RJ is ahead of me. He wanted to say it. We're going to be in uh, on 94. I-94, we are currently on I-29, well, we're just taking the exit ramp right now, but... to the left on I-94 East. Yeah, so we'll be going towards Minneapolis. That's right. I was looking at the radar earlier, and, uh... It looks like there's some snow further, uh, further east, so, uh... We might actually be running into some, uh snow yet today not quite that fast I'm adjusting my wiper speed I don't want them to be too crazy fast but needed to be a little slower but yeah so we might be running into some snow yet today that's right that ain't gonna be good because that's gonna be making it for dangerous conditions. But I would like to get at least another hour worth of driving in, so continue on this road for 160 miles. It's gonna be miles. right about where I want to be spending the night at, so and that's right about where the snow will start too. It looked like on the radar, so uh, so yeah, that might be about where we're gonna call it a day might be about where we're going to be done I know it's probably going to make for a short video but uh, figured better something than nothing right that's what I like to say so let's get on down the road and let's see what else we'll be able to show you alrighty ladies and gentlemen <clears throat> we are in uh, Fergus Falls Minnesota that's right. I was going to go up to Suck Center, Minnesota tonight, but <clears throat> ah, figured this is good enough already. I only needed to go far enough so uh, to where I can easily make it after tomorrow. So by Sunday night, we should be at our, uh, or really close to our delivery place, like the closest truck stop where we can find. That's where we're going to be parked for Sunday night. That's a plan anyways, but uh, I am tired today. I don't know why, but last night was a little bit better sleep, I think. But the night before, I didn't sleep very good. So I am going to go to bed here right away and get me a good night's sleep. So I know this video is probably going to be a bit of a short one, but hopefully it's short and sweet. We uh, <clears throat> try to make it a good video every day, but... You know, I got a comment there on the, my video today saying that uh, me showing that truck that was doing an illegal turn there the other day wasn't a good idea. And I don't know. I mean, uh, yeah, I do agree to a certain extent. Maybe it wasn't the best idea, but I was just doing that as an entertainment uh, or, or whatever, you know. I didn't really mean that to show as a negative way too much but i guess it came out or it came across as a bit of a negative i guess and uh but whatever we do try and make a good interesting video every day and it doesn't always work out like that like i said before it uh sometimes it might be a good video and 
sometimes it's not such a good video but no matter what we try and make a video and uh, I'm hoping that you guys enjoyed yesterday's video I really had a blast up there by all the ice sculptures and ice slides and all that fun stuff so really hope that you guys enjoyed that video at least there should be no negativity on that one I think so uh, anyways that's about all I got for today so I hope you guys had a good day uh, we will catch you on the next one behind me that day is gonna come I'm breaking the wall